how do for we those get that have to ears. get out of the mind frame where I only can vote for Democrat or Republican, right? I, I say it all the time. A lot of people are, are from years and years and years of grandparents voting Democrat and, and great grandparents and then parents and then yourselves. How do we get them out to think outside of the box, right? Because automatically when somebody sees somebody running as an independent, they think, well, he is or she is, there's no way that they can possibly win. They're just somebody in there to start trouble and to, to mess up the, the Democrats. So how do we get people to change that view? Yeah, I think part of it is, you know, Curtis Mayfield got this song, No Thing On Me. I'm so glad I got my own, so glad that I can see my life is a natural high. The man can't put no thing on me. It depends on what you see. When, you, we, when we see, we have to see a system. You can't just look at two parties. You got to see how both of them are tied to Wall Street and Pentagon. Both of them tied to war. Both of them tied to greed. And so you have to have an understanding of how the system operates and then say, ah, I want to be critical of the system. I'm not just critical of Trump's gangsterism. I can see how Trump's gangsterism is inseparable from Biden's genocidal policies facilitating genocide in Gaza. So you begin to see how the system operates and connects what's happening with the Palestinians in Gaza or what's happening in black folk in Harlem, what's happening with poor whites in Kentucky, what's happening with poor Latinos in East L.A. And that is a different way of seeing the world. That's why our artists at the, at the height, the Nina Simones and others, they help us to see things we didn't see. Mm -hmm. Then the question becomes, how do you implement? How do you execute? Usually, when you see and you raise your voice, you get incarcerated or assassinated. That's what the system does to free black people. So you have to be willing to pay that cost. And that's exactly what the cost we're willing to pay. How come? Because we love the people. Mm -hmm. And the only thing that breaks the back of fear is love. And if you don't love the people, then get out of the way and go on and sell out. Go on and sell your soul for a mess of pottage and tell people lies. Tell them how great Biden is. Tell him Biden has always been concerned with profile. No, he's an architect of mass incarceration. That's a crime against humanity. I've taught in prison for 41 years. I've seen it go from 200,000 to 2.3 million right before my very eyes. That's a crime against humanity. That's my brothers and sisters in there. Don't lie. Don't, don't won't be lying on Biden in that sense. So it's that kind of truth telling that we need. And that's kind of and it's rooted in love. Why, why do they 